What's up, Zombie Slayers? Thank you for hanging out with me today. This is KJ48, and welcome back to Seven Days to Die. So I've gotten nice and organized. I went ahead and harvested a bunch of stuff for gunpowder, and we have gunpowder being made. Um, gunpowder takes forever. So uh, it's going to take some time. It won't be ready for this episode, but that's okay. It'll be there when I get back. I'm also cooking clay into my forges, so I don't have to worry about it later. And I am also making some concrete. We're going to do another building episode next episode. I want to get this house, uh, this whole base um, situated. We really need to put an electric fence around this place. Uh, folks, show. That would be awesome. Um, apparently, I was making... Uh, yeah, I'm going to need a lot of paint. I was making paint last episode. So let's go ahead and let that paint finish. And today, we're going to be going out and doing some POIs. Now, here's the thing, guys. Here's the thing. I don't think I can do quests anymore. I went ahead and looked at the quest the trader had uh, before the video. Uh, and, you know, I, it, it, not going to work. Not going to work. I even went into DM mode, forced the trader to reset their quests. Because I'm trying to get buildings I haven't done yet. And they're giving me the same buildings over and over. Now, there's only three, um, what am I, Trader Hue? I, I think I got Trader Hue. Uh, so there's only three Trader Hues on this map. And they're here. Uh, I think it's, yeah, I think it's here as well. No, I think it's down here. Yeah, that looks about the same. Yeah, here, here, and here. Those are the only Trader Hughes. That's gonna, that's gonna be a problem because, um, I went down here. These, these Traders do not give me quests in the north. At least, I didn't reset the quest down here, so maybe I could try and do that. Uh, but yeah, these, um, quests down here were not giving me quests in the north. Neither was this one. They were giving me quests everywhere but the north, okay? And this guy is giving me the same quest over and over no matter how many times I restart, I reset their, their trader quests. So I think what I'm going to do is, um, I didn't reset this trader's quest here. So this trader's close enough to the wasteland. I could get some buildings in the wasteland, but um, honestly, I really don't know if, that, if that's going to happen. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to go to trader one. I'm going to go into DM mode, check, their, check the quest that they give, and see if we can get something in the, you know, wasteland. I don't want to do anything but the wasteland. I mean... We're in the wasteland. That's what I want to do. But if I do quests, they're going to be the same buildings over and over again. So um, I did go up here and look at some interesting POIs in this area. So if I do go up there and I don't get a quest, I'll just do some, you know, POIs in the area. And, um, you know, we'll just not do quests. It kind of sucks. Um, but, you know, it is what it is. All right. So, I mean, hey, if you guys want to see the same buildings over and over, if you don't mind because they're quests, let me know in the comments. And if you don't want to see it, let me know in the comments. I want to know what you guys think because I want you guys to enjoy these videos. So, um, just let me know what you think. I would think doing the same buildings over and over would not be preferable. But, you know, if you guys feel differently, let me know. All right. I love coming out here and having my bike out. This is like a great place. Oh, I love this place so freaking much. I come out here. I get my bike. I go this way. I got to break out all these bars. Uh, and like th these bars are not supposed to be there. This is all supposed to be one thing uh, So I got to break out those bars at some point and I got to get an electric fence around this entire place But um, overall though, I think the base is looking pretty dope All right, so what I'm gonna do now is I'm gonna go to trader one I'm gonna wait for it to open and then we'll go in there and see if we can get a quest in the wasteland All right, so here you are in DM mode if you want to get in the DM mode you just type DM you type the tilde key All right, I'm sorry F1 and then you type in DM all right once you get in the DM mode you talk to the trader uh, admin options, reset quests. I've reset his quest quite a few times. He did have a couple in the wasteland, but they were all buildings I've already like done been to. Um, yeah, household. Yeah, I've, I've done all these. Okay, he doesn't have anything for me. All right, fair enough. I get, we don't have to do quests. Not really that big of a deal. Um, it's just like this is kind of a limitation of the game. Like, there's only so many tier four quests. Now, I know what you're thinking. Cage, do a tier five quest. Um, I think I'm going to. I think I'm going. Not this episode. But I think uh, maybe a, in a couple more episodes. I'm not, I'm not really sure. Um, but I, I'm going to... I hate saying I'm going to do a Tier 5 because shit comes up. But I, I have every intention of doing a Tier 5. Um, probably within the next few episodes. I want next episode to be a building episode. Maybe I'll do the Tier 5 episode next episode. We'll see. The problem with doing Tier 5 is when you're on 60 minute days, forget about it. You're not finishing it. All right? And I know there's people out there who are super pro and like re really like just gods at the game. And they can finish five tier fives in one 60 minute like day cycle that's that's fine uh, i don't have the skill to do that um if i go out there to do a tier five quest it is going to be multiple nights um and i could either fight through the night 
or I could kind of find a little hidey hole in the um, in the tier five POI and kind of hide around and wait for day. It all depends uh, because you know um, if, with the dangerous cities mod, like fighting during the night is really just not the best idea in the world. Um, we'll see. I, nothing set in stone except for the fact that I do want to do a tier five. Will we get to it? Probably. <laughs> Probably. I'm gonna do. I'm gonna like make every effort um, to be able to get to that tier five. All right, so what we're gonna do now is we got that POI thing up there, so we are just going to mark that, and we're gonna go there. I scattered out this area, and um, it looks pretty dope, and we're gonna kind of check it out. Um, it's like a building I've seen, and um, I believe it's a building that people in Discord have told me they've never seen before, so they've never done. I, I don't know. So we're gonna go check it. I know I've never done it before, so we're gonna go check it out. Yeah, the whole tier five thing, I don't know. Six, I, I'm going to be honest with you guys. I want to play 90 minute days. I don't like 60 minute days, but I do like the way 60 minute days pushes your game stage. I don't think the game stage goes up quickly enough in this game, uh, considering how much experience you get and stuff like that. Uh, and the 60 minute days, just so you guys know, in case you don't, in case you don't understand what I'm talking about in this game, uh, that as the days go by, that ups your game stage, game stage ups the difficulty of the zombies you're going to face. And I want that to go up. I want more difficult zombies earlier. More experience, more fat loot. I just want it to be exciting. I don't want to take a hundred videos just to get to the good stuff, you know? Um, so that's what I do. And uh, that's why I'm on like 150% experience in this Let's Play. I think I think 150% experience is just right. I think it's just right. So uh, which way do you want to go? Nope, that's the wrong way. Got to go this way. Uh, so that's kind of what I'm, that's kind of how I think about it. And, um, you know, I like 90 minute days. I wish I could play 90 minute days and still get that boost to the, um, game stage. Like, uh, because it's just 60 minutes. Uh, it's just not enough. In my opinion, a lot of people on discord I talk to agree with me as well. Um, but it does make the nights very quick, but honestly, I don't know how quickly I want them. To, I mean, I don't know. I use the nights to do things. Sometimes I get home and by the time I'm done sorting out the loot from that day, uh, the night's over. <laughs> I don't even get to go farm or anything. I don't get to go like dig up anything under my base so i don't know uh but the, the fact of the matter is i'm gonna stick with six minute days because it is pushing my game stage and i do appreciate that um that is really awesome what is my game stage 130 okay yeah it is pushing my game stage so that is really nice um but you know that makes doing tier fives really difficult especially if i don't want to be out at, if i don't want to be doing them at night you know you get a a wandering horde or like the um the, i mean i can barely handle the tier fives now during the day <laughs> well, the tier... Actually, I take that back. I haven't done a tier 5 yet. But I've had to run from... Actually, have I only ran from one tier 4? You know what? I think I've only run from one tier 4. But there's been a couple where I thought I was going to have to run. So, I don't know. We'll see. Everything's up in the air. I'm going to try my best to do a tier 5, though. I think... I think uh, The more I think about that, the more I think I want to do it. I'll probably do the apartment buildings. Or not the apartment buildings. But that, like, brick. It's called Brick 6 or something like that. There's a lot of concrete and cobblestone at the top of that one. It's a pretty challenging one, too. Master, we are not and um, when I'm in it, if I get stuck in it during the day, you know, during the night, I don't know. I might fight through during the night. I might not. I don't know. We'll just kind of see. Anyway, here's the uh, POI I was telling you guys about. I mean, this one looks uh, pretty freaking cool. So let's check it out. It's really weird to not see the quest marker. I'm like, am I in the right spot? I can't be in the right spot. So here we are. And um, again, I've never done this. I've never done this place. This would make a dope place to live in a multiplayer series, right? Don't you think? Oh, I remember another thing about quests. Don't quest up the difficulty of the zombies when you go to a POI. I remember. I remember doing non-quest stuff last season, or not last season. Yeah, last season, my last uh, series. And when I did it, if I remember correctly, maybe I, maybe I'm not remembering correctly. Um, if I remember correctly. Uh, you don't get the same difficulty of zombies unless it's a quest. I don't know. Maybe that's just maybe I was just crazy, but kind of felt it kind of felt like the, the zombies were a little bit easier than usual. And the only difference is I wasn't doing a quest. All right, so we're gonna put all this. Uh, I'll hold on to all that stuff because I'm gonna be looting more of it. Damn freaking hiccups! Oh my goodness, it's early in the morning. I'm talking a lot, and that does you tend to give me hiccups. Stupid hiccups. I kind of want to loot everything because I've been playing Darkness Falls. I think I mentioned this last episode or something. I don't know. But um, I've been playing Darkness Falls. And Darkness Falls has Learn By Doing. which My senses have picked up something. And what Learn By Doing means is 
let's say you're playing a scavenger class. Um, Darkness Falls has classes. Let's say you're playing a scavenger class, right? Um, I'm not gonna break. I'm not gonna break that up. Uh, you what, what you what you would do is you would like loot, and every time you loot, the, Seven Days of Night used to be like this. If you're playing on console, it might still be like this. When you loot stuff, you get skills, and the more you or when you do anything, when you shoot, when you mine, you just get skills for all that stuff, and it's it's called learn by doing. Oh, I'm punching him right in the balls. You ain't gonna blow up, bro. Man, those, those feral cops are pretty badass. I'm not gonna lie. Ow. Okay, this seems pretty pretty good. Doesn't seem like seems about normal for these for these POIs, whether I'm questing or not. So I'm looting a lot of stuff I wouldn't normally loot, but that's okay. That's okay. It's all good. Oh boy. Check out my inventory, man. It's completely unlocked. I love it. And awesome. It's kind of funny the freedom you have when you're not doing a quest. Like, I don't have to worry about going too far away from the POI or anything like that. Always loot the refrigerators. Ugh, gross. Uh, oh, I'll take that. Drink. And drink. Do it. Pop goes the head. Uh, you get brass from these? Eh, a little bit. Actually, that's a real little bit. 14. I'm not sure it's worth the time to swing the thing. <laughs> sure, it adds up, though, if you get a few of them. Wait, what? Okay. Is that a fake clock? What the hell? Whoop. Yeah, no, seriously, what the hell is this? Is the clock part of the wall? Is that a thing? No, the clock is, like, a piece. That's weird. Just put a regular clock up there, man. I want to wrench this shit. <laughs> Ain't gonna be able to tend no time on a clock like that. I still need mechanical parts. I gotta remember to buy the mechanical parts from the traders as well. It's not something I'm used to, you know, doing, but I should probably get used to it. What's up, bro? Are you hiding? Get up. Sit down. All right. My senses have picked up something. Oh, they have, huh? Oh, they have, huh? Uh, you know what? I'm not going to throw a damn thing out until I have to. Punchy, punchy, facey, facey. You see the black dots on my on my screen? See them right there, there, there. That always ends up happening. I'm not sure what that is. Oh, you got no head, bro. Boom. Yeah, um, well, I am getting some ferals. So I was just about to say, it does feel a little bit easier than a quest POI. You know what's weird? I'm not, I don't, Dangerous Cities mod, I, I feel like, well, you know what? This doesn't really feel like it's in the middle of anything. Now that I'm looking outside. I mean, well, it's got a tier 5 tower across the street. Boom! Yo, one ugly mother, okay, I'm not gonna, I can't. I can't. I'm not good at accents of any kind i can't do any i think i could do italian like but that's because i'm from new jersey and i grew up with italians uh no i'm not italian but i grew up with them and i watch the sopranos i know i know what's up there we go i've got a bad feeling about this oh you do huh why don't you tell me more about it sir What's up, bro? Wake up, douchebag. What a dumbass. <laughs> That's probably the way to go. There's this laser, like, wrench. Oh, a freaking radiate. Oh, she's dead. And she's gone. 
Oh my god, it's irradiated and she's gone. Uh, what was I gonna say? Uh, damn it, I don't remember. Oh, get the hell out of here. What's up, my man? I love it when the, uh, when the fast ones get caught behind the slow ones, because it's like the slow ones are just a, a, they're such a waste of space. And then they, what they do is they block the fast ones, so they make the fast ones even, like, weaker. Man, breaking glass left and right. Man, you put your hand through a plane of glass like that in a survival situation, you're gonna be hurting. Alright, let's do this. See, again, I want to use my guns because I want to up my rifle skill. <laughs> or my automatic weapon skill. But, yeah, that's not... This is not Darkness Falls. And it seems like we're starting to get some zombies now. I'm starting to wake everybody up. Don't forget, I haven't used my guns. Should I go for point two and lose the resistance, the explosive resistance? I don't think so. What's up, my man? Boom! Boom! Goes the head. All right. All right, doing pretty dope. Pretty dope. So I think the trick to, uh, I think the trick to Dangerous Cities mod when you go into a you know a city is to don't ignore the zombies but continue up the the POI because if you just sit at the entrance and try and clear the zombies it's never gonna happen uh, they respawn faster than you can clear them so don't even bother just defend yourself as they get to you and work your way up the tower or whatever your whatever POI you're doing. Oh, boy. I would imagine the bigger POIs might be easier in a way. Because, uh, you know, you get away from the ground as you climb up them. Like a tier 1 POI, like a building or something, you're just sitting there on the bottom floor, like, the whole time. And it, it makes you more susceptible to the to the hordes. So. A lot of stone. A lot of stone in the trash. Who's throwing away so much dying. stone for? See, now if any if any hordes come in from the street, they gotta make their way up to me. You know? I'll hear them. I'll be able to get ready for it. In theory. What are you doing, woman? Oh, boy. Okay. Go. By the way, I put a third point into... Or fourth point into my fist of cuffs. Yeah, brothers four or five. Healing factors three or five. Pain tolerance three or five. So I'm starting to become a, a bit of a, of a machine here, just laying waste, laying waste to the wasteland. Do you think the wasteland was in bad shape? You ain't seen nothing yet. Just wait until KG48 gets there. I'm talking so much shit. It's gonna be so sweet when they kill me in the tier five POI. Well, sweet, sweet for them. Okay. Very good. Sounds like there's some baddies down there. But, I don't know. They're going to have a hard time getting to me. And if they do get to me, I'll be ready. And that's all you can really ask for. Okay. Alright, should we take care I've of this one? Yeah, let's this. do it. I don't know. It sounds like they're below, but are they up top? I don't know. We're going to find out. This is a pretty cool POI. It's not bad. I wonder what tier it is. I, it can't be a tier 4. Wouldn't I have gotten a quest for it? I mean, like, how far can quests go? I don't know. I feel like if I can get a tier 4 quest here, and this is a tier 4, I should have been got, I should have gotten one for it. I have no idea how, the, um, how they pick their quests. You have to send more ferals if you guys if you guys are gonna defeat me. These guys on the ground keep hitting me, man. I'm not, I'm not seeing them down there. Might have to go to guns here. I'm going to try not to. I mean, there's, there's no ferals here. Well, there's one. 
<laughs> now there's no ferals here. Oh boy. Oh boy. Alright, I'm really playing games here, which I shouldn't be doing. Ah, they fell! What a bunch of numb nuts. Alright, I feel like actually using the gun. You dumbasses. Actually, I'm not going to call you dumbasses because I'm pretty sure I almost fell a couple times. And um, honestly, I'm kind of surprised I didn't because I wasn't really paying enough attention. I was paying some attention to it, but probably not enough. Okay. It's funny. I was like, is there a... Um, I was thinking, is there a... Uh, 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 what is it? I forget what it's called. A supplies in here? Yeah, is there a supplies in here? I'm like, I'm thinking it's a quest. Oh boy. They're not happy with me. What are you doing, bro? Oh, he's trying to help his buddies out of there. That's cool. I don't really think that's what he's doing. I think he's messed up, but... Alright, we are infected. We will not be infected for long. Damn it! Stop hitting me! Jerk! Okay. Oh, there wasn't anyone in here? I thought there was someone in here. Here's one in your ear. I hear a lot of walking, but I don't see a lot of zombies. Oh, there they are. Where are they? They're below me? I don't know. Who cares? My senses have picked up something. The cool thing is, uh, if they fall down below, I don't have to worry about it. Because, like, normally you'd be like, oh, I have to clear out all the zombies. So you'd have to you'd have to worry about them like falling below. Like, oh, I'm not gonna go find them, right? But not a quest. Here we go. I should probably have taken some more coffee before I did this. Oh, we seem to be doing all right. I keep thinking that's a cop in there because of the blue. I got a few ferals here, but they're coming at me one at a time. It's like in a martial arts movie when they attack the they attack the hero like one at a time. Stay down. Okay. Let's make sure we're all reloaded. Haven't had to go to the big guns. Cool. This is a really cool POI. I like it. I wish I could get some quests for it. Um, I even checked nighttime quests, and this wasn't this wasn't an opportunity. We got up here. Oh, damn it! I gotta know. Master, we are not alone. Ah, damn it, lady! I'm trying to find out what's up there. All right, you done? You done. All right, let's see if we can get up here now without more interference. We got to break that one too. And then I think I could just replace the ladders or, you know, fill in the ladders. Uh, ladder, please. There we go. Beautiful. That's actually pretty cool. I like that. Uh, okay. Oh, an ammo pouch. Cool. Damn it. Look, I didn't hurt myself there. Alright, let's, uh, do the. I kind of want to look around. Come on, man. Come on, man. Alright, there we go. Alright, this, this is starting to give me, uh, I'm not sure if it's vertigo, 
or whatever. I'm starting to get freaked out. You guys ever watch on the YouTube channels those people who climb those big freaking towers and with their GoPro on their heads? That's what I'm feeling right now. Except I'm the right, idiot climbing the tower with the GoPro. Down. And I got a zombie below me. And now he's dead. Alright, cool. Let's go get that loot. Uh, oh boy. Ah! Thanks for the loot bag, douchebag. Okay, it's a little tricky to get down these ladders properly. There we go. Climbing ladders is not this game's strong suit. Okay. Alright, let's see what we got in here. Uh, hey, you. Where's my eye candy? And I'll also use my jailbreakers. What the fuck is that? Mm. Fuck out of here. <laughs> Alright, let's do it. Oh, hell yeah, man. There's a lot of ammo in there. That's a spicy bit the ball. I should probably check my, my loot stage. Ugh, I don't have any room for anything. I've been informed by Sarah, reliably, that we need to prepare for conflict. Really? This is your idea of conflict? That's my idea of a... She's a speed bump to me. Barely. Uh, not even. Like one of those weak speed bumps you don't even pay attention to. Alright, let's break these open. Let's get some loot. And let's go turn in the quest. No, we're not turning in the quest. There's no quest. Cage, what are you talking about? Alright. And might as well not even bother trying to unlock that. Oh boy, we got our... We got our wait, okay. All right, now we're getting real. It's not so bad. Like, that wasn't really a lot of, like, zombies. But the fact... Oh, okay, here we go. But the fact of the matter is I was cornered. All right, here we go. Not much range on this gun unless you aim. <laughs> but that's to be expected for an M60. Am I going to be able to, like, actually... Like, loot this thing? Oh god, what a numb nuts. I guess his brain is partially rotted, so it kind of makes sense. Alright, let's loot this thing. We've got one minute left. Oh wait, no, we got seven minutes. we got seven minutes left on the jailbreakers. A little over, uh, two, well, two and a half minutes on the loot candy. And there we go. Not bad. Not bad at all. Nice, solid loot there. Solid loot. We just gotta get out of here. I should have brought some more shit drops. I never buy those damn things. Kill you all. You're all gonna die. I guess, we, I guess we're gonna have to register you as a lethal weapon. Right, I gotta try and get down this place. They do path up there pretty nicely from the street. I will say that. Can I jump down? Yeah, sure. Why not? No, that's a little far. Ugh. I'm out of a choice. Excuse me. Excuse me. Coming through. Oh, I never went up there. Alright, whatever. Let's get out of here. Hey! Oh, can't do that. <laughs> I think I shoot my way out. Oh, there's a lot of guys around here. <laughs> a lot of zombies! See, that's what I'm saying, though. Like, if you try and kill everything from the street, it's never going to happen. They're just going to keep respawning. So. All right, guys. Well, I will call that a success. That was pretty fun. Um, interesting POI. I hope you guys enjoyed it. If you did, make sure you uncage that like button. Also, if you're new here, please subscribe for more daily videos. Thank you very much for watching. I'll see you next time. And until then, take I it easy. Everybody.